Hi, it's Eve. I have a lot to tell you. First, uh, I'll show you something interesting. <clears throat> this is Edwin Birdsong, who was also Bach and Irving Berlin and General Robert E. Lee. He left the earth because he couldn't have sex and he couldn't drive a car and he saw no reason to keep living, although he had great-grandchildren, which is what he said to me. I said, let's do a Broadway musical, trying to give him a new lease on life. Because what he's been doing is spending all his money buying love from all these people who say they are his children, when in fact he only has one biological child, a sing bird song, Mozart, George Gershwin, King Charlemagne, uh, projected himself as Sly Stone. And, and, and lots of other people, Jimi Hendrix, okay? So what I want to show you is Edwin's pose. You see his finger is pointing up? You see Singh's finger is pointing up? That's if Edwin had pointed that finger up at his girlfriend's, it should have been his wife's clitoris, and tickled it with that finger until she... Uh, received enough pleasure, uh, just relaxing, taking his time, tickling, 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 no matter how long it takes until she succumbs and then he succumbs with her. That feeling would have given him a reason to keep living. My brother, a Sikh, Gurinder Singh Dillon, told me years ago, sex is the basis for life. Okay? I finally found out what he meant. This is God, Bob Dylan. When he was a star in the sky, he fell in love with Venus. I got a picture. Venus, the evening star. She twinkled so brightly. He was it was hypnotized by the light, mesmerized by the light her light. So he wanted to touch her. So he willed creation and he willed uh, bodies for them to enter with fingers so he could touch her. Okay, so then Adam and Eve showed up. This is Adam. Michael Bublé. He'd be as Elvis, Frank Sinatra, Ray Charles, he's always singing I'm Blind, and he'd be as um, uh, who's my, uh, Michael Jackson, George Harrison, I think that's uh, and Jesse Belvin, okay? Now, that's Adam and Eve. Who is Eve? E-V-O-L, L-O-V-E. Eve is love vibrating, okay, vibrating God, still one, order ring, ring, engagement ring, what's this, he loves Eve, vibrating and also E.B. Edwin Birdsong, Bach, General Edwin Lee, General Robert E. Lee loves Eve, love vibrating. She was also Mary Magdalene, Venus. She started out being Venus, vibrating, love. Dylan, U.S. That's what she's doing now. Okay, and Muhammad loved uh, Mary Magdalene. Muhammad is Dr. Jordan B. Peterson, and uh, he visits her in his spirit. And Stevie Wonder, love Venus, Sharia Moore. They walk down the aisle together. In 1967, 
and created a new life named Robin Birdsong. This is Galileo. Last time I spoke to her, she told me she was in the air because they walked down the aisle on the causal plane. Okay. And he doesn't know she's his child, his only biological child. She was Helen Keller. Nobody else could believe that a blind man like Steve is perfect as a father for their child. But Helen Keller couldn't see or hear. So the fact that he could hear was a plus. And she heard that song, she be more, she fell in love with him and they conceived a child. Okay, so you got, uh, and then Jesus fell in love with Mary Magdalene, of course. And he's been in her life in different forms, singing to her as uh, Dean Martin, Jerry Butler, who protected himself as Paul Simon, Jackie Wilson. She saw Jackie Wilson in person and she conceived a child with him to be loved. Oh, what a feeling to be loved, he sang to her. And he got her heart, so she conceived his child. She was 12 years old, her mother made her abort the baby. She didn't want to, but she thought her mother was God. So if her mother wants her to abort her baby, she'll do anything her mother says. Because when she was four years old, her mother told her, I never wanted you. I tried to kill you. I tried to abort you. About my ears rang like dinner bells. And she always laughed when she said that. That was funny to her. The Beatles, Paul McCartney wrote a song. Michelle, my belle. Her name is Michelle this life. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, he sang. And then he sang to her in French. She loves French. So she loves that song. There's a guy here at St. Francis of Assisi, Residence 3, where she lives. Here he is. He sings that song to her. And his French is perfect.